Hello and welcome to Dr. Lunatic, Supreme of Cheese. I'm gonna play this game. This random ass game. Seems like it's a bit off screen there, but that shouldn't matter. No, it's fine. Okay, so I've already uh, gone ahead and done the tutorial and played a few levels of Spooky Forest. Um, I'm actually gonna start off with Carnivorous Caves. Yes. So, what is this game? Well, you're a guy. And he likes to have hand movements with his hand. Basically, you throw hammers and you've got to collect brains. Yeah, are you a zombie? No. You're just a guy. Mineshaft 1. I pick up a torch. Yes, you get points in this game. What can you do with the points? Nothing! Oh, I can't get in the equipment shed. Looks like I'm just going this way for now. Yes, there's a guy. Manager's office? Hell no. I have no weapons. What can I do? I have a key. Right, try and get to the manager's office before I get bummed. Ah, he's stuck in a corner. It's fine. <laughs> Aha! Sweet you get. You can't get me. Oh no, he got me. And again. Oh well. Doesn't matter if you take damage, you can just get some more. So, we've got some equipment. You're a maniac in this game. You throw hammers in all directions and they bounce. It's, it's a lot of fun. Let's go down the mine shaft. Will we kill the pygmy? And got a brain. Course brains of this guy. Not for me. I'm not a zombie. Ah, oh, god damn it. Ah, uh, weird bloke. More brains? Any more brains? Oh, that's a cow. Not a brain. So, I uh, got all the candles on the level, and I get a bonus. If you get all the candles and all the collectibles, you unlock something at the end of the hub, and this is fun. It's, it's all good. Die! Give me your brains! I swear that guy said moo. I'm cool, cat bear. I'm cool, cat bear. Yes. The smelter. Do I want to go in there? I'm not sure. Let's destroy it. No. No, that hurts. Okay. Let's try and find our way out then, shall I? Shall we? Let's uh, go this way. Is it back here? There we go. I got gallery thing. You completed the brain mines! And we got 18 coins. Awesome. Oh, 28 coins. What are coins used for? Well, let's find out. By going to the shop. There's quite a lot of content in this game, I must say. All these shops you can go in. Each has a world you can unlock. 90 coins? No. I want to get lucky and try and find a prize like this. Zapparatus? No. What's this? Frozen yogurt. Okay, no, I'm fine. I'll I'll stick with without frozen yogurt, thank you. Isn't that called a froggut? Frogut. <coughs> yes. <coughs> because bats make that noise. Any more shops? More worlds and what looks like a secret world. Nope, it's just 
I thought it was Secret World because that's like the, the icon you use. Never mind. Just uh, some decoration. Oh well. Nope. Bunny rabbits. Yes. More stuff. Handy record book. How many coins do I have? 28? Uh, I don't think I'll be able to buy anything anytime soon. Let's see what F. What, there's a cheat menu. You can have cheats in this game. This looks too colourful. And lockers. These are awesome. Yes. Each one gives you, like, a bonus or a little gimmick thing they unlock. And, uh, it's fun. The only way to unlock it is to uh, have keys. See on the bottom right corner? There you go, there's some keys. How do you get these keys? You gotta get 100% on a world and you'll get a key. Yep. So, that's uh, theatres and art. And let's, let's just go back to the game, shall we? Quit and play. Next level. What is it this time? Twisty tunnel. Gotta be careful, someone's sleeping. And that green alien thing is chasing me. Hammer off. I'm going to kill it with my hammer. Thingy. I killed a thingy. Hmm, looks like a cave in. Can I destroy it? No! So what do I do? There's a wall here that looks like a break. Aha! Gotta keep an eye out. Lots of secrets in this game. Lots and lots of secrets. More thingies. Luckily, they're weak, and I can kill them. I got all of them. Was that it? Really? Wow. That was the best level ever. I got a perfect and coins. Next level. We're going spelunk a bit. Hammer off. Got myself a hammer. I killed a thingy. Didn't know I killed it. Oh well. This looks like a maze of some sort. Ow. Bastard. Die. More coins. Ow! Well, I know where the exit is now. Well, I've got all the uh, little tidbit things. I got Orbit Bomb. I'm cool, Cat Bear. Okay, random item. So, we've got all the candles and all the brains. We can exit the level now. And for passing 25 levels. Damn straight. Finished that level, and uh, I think I'll do one more. Uh, that looks scary. Let's go over here. Top left corner. Let's do this level and uh, I'll call it an episode. Oh god, bats. I'll take the damage. I want, I want my hammer. Damn, bats. A day at the shore. It's very deadly looking shore there. Bats! The most deadliest enemy in any game. Bats. Do I want that? Okay, I think I do. Oh yeah, skills. You don't know my skills. So, this looks like some sort of puzzle. To get pants and a candle. Gotta be careful. Don't want to uh, mess up. Um, what do we want to do here? Oh, yourself, you bastard. I'm sure I wanted to do that for some reason. Um, I'm not going to get anywhere doing that, so... Yes, well done. Um, I have no idea what I'm doing. Ah! 
Yes, pants. That was quite the puzzle. And a candle. And stuff is spreading like disease stuff. I got a machete. I'm going to slowly take care of this until I find something worth getting. I got a coin. What is that? I want that. Toaster! Yes, awesome. 20 combo, eh? We also get a scanner, which we can scan stuff. The least intelligent adversary, since it's Moss. I think I'm the only one who finds the name of this one and the following to be enormously clever. I kept trying to convince others to the cleverness, but they didn't seem to agree. Both players and monsters are freely walk on Monster Mus. The only difference being, the player finds it unpleasantly tingly. Also, mines. Hopefully they don't hurt me. Nope, they don't. Die, evil monster thing! You don't belong here. You actually do belong here. Spears! Die, evil thing! Why is it still spreading? Oh yes, the axe. Axe is the best to take out these guys. As you can see, I got a hundred, hundred combo. Cause I'm just a cool cat bear. I've also got some more mines. And a machete! Zappy wand! For zapness! And more scanners. We also got veggie! I like the animation these use when they shoot. They twist their ice dogs together until their eyes clack into each other. Like one of those two balls on a string toys. For some reason, the clacking causes two bullets to fly in every direction. They spawn Monju Mask at a high rate, if there are any open spots for it in the four tiles around them. To really kickstart the growth of Moss Field, Moss Grenades are key. Not to mention being much more threatening than Muncho Moss to begin with. Die! Bomb! Food! Wantons! And a shield! Zappy wand. Because you're zappy. We also got a machine gun. More stuff. Pants. Pants make you throw hammers faster. For some unknown reason. And that exploded. I don't have that key. Actually, yes I do. <coughs> I lied! What's down here? More reddish. What? what? I don't know what that is. It's something! Anyway, we finished the level. Dun -dun 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 -dun. Oh, 98%. We missed something. That was destruction, though. Oh well, we get loads of coins. And points! On the next episode of Let's Play Dr. Lunatic Supreme of Cheese, I will be doing some more dastardly cave action. Until next time, see you then. More! Ice spinning. And.